Do you know, out of 20 people who smoke, 19 of them started smoking as a teenager. That's right. Whenever someone starts smoking, they never think that it's going to become a problem for them. Everyone thinks that I can get rid of it whenever I want. But before you know it, your body and mind becomes addicted and dependent on it. That's because cigarette smoking is designed to make you an addict. Cigarette smoking is perhaps the most addictive substance. Quitting is hard, but it's possible. Two out of three people who smoke want to quit, but the nicotine withdrawal and craving makes it very hard for them to do so. Here are five tips for you to quit like a champ. First thing is to have a clear purpose. Ask yourself, why do I want to quit? Having a clear purpose will help you in difficult times. Some people want to quit for their loved ones. Some want a better life. Some want to have more control of their behaviors. What's your reason to quit? Number two, set a quit date. Setting a date will make you more motivated towards working that goal and has a higher chance for you to actually quit. Number three, once you quit smoking, you will need something to replace that habit. This is more important in times of strong urge when your body really wants you to light up another cigarette. During this time, keep your mind and hands busy with something else. You could eat a healthy snack, you could chew on a straw, you could draw something, or play a game on your phone or call a friend. Find ways to keep your hands and mind busy during this strong urge and after some time this urge will go away. Also list down the triggers and environment that prompts you to smoke and try to avoid those environments and those situations. Number four, use medicines to help you quit. You are three times more likely to quit if you use the right medicines to help you fight the withdrawal and craving. One such medicine is called Chantax. Apart from that, you can also use nicotine replacement therapy. You can use a patch that gives you a small amount of nicotine to the body so that you're not craving that much. And in times of intense urge, you can use a nicotine gum, lozenges or sprays to give you a small spike of nicotine in the body so that your urge settles down. Now remember, using nicotine patch and gums are still much more safer than using a cigarette because cigarette also contains many harmful chemicals and carcinogens that can damage your body. Consult your doctor to figure out what's the right medicine for you. Number five, tell your family and friends that you are about to quit smoking. This way they can understand your day-to-day -day challenges and help you in this journey. Keep in mind that it might actually take you multiple attempts to finally quit. So don't give up and don't lose hope. Every cigarette you avoid is helping you and the people around you. And once you quit, become a champion and help others in their journey. Stay healthy and help others stay healthy.